So Barbie movie is a fraud and I will tell you why while I'm doing Barbie look. Hi everyone, it's Nisha. So today we are going to have a bit of fun and um, to celebrate the Barbie movie, not that I'm going to go and see it, <laughs> I'm going to do grown up Barbie look. I've got my foundation on and my brows. I am going just to put a bit more bronzer on. I'm just using the Sun Lava Glow from Catrice. It's got a bit of shimmer to it. So, why do I think that Barbie movie is a fraud? Because no one looks like Margot Robbie at 64. Yes, Barbie is 64. Barbie was born, or her first doll created, in, I think, 1959. So, she should be 64 but she was created as an 18 year old I think so she's about 83 Margot Robbie is beautiful though isn't she let's do lovely pink blush Too Faced Cloud Crush blush in Golden Hour Wouldn't it be fun if they did Barbie movie when she's in her 60s? So, yes, Barbie is older than me. And Barbie should have wrinkles, eye bags, hooded eyes. She probably is having hot flashes and night sweats. And also... Barbie must be knackered because in her entire life she had, I think, over 200 jobs. I'm going to use a highlighter. This is from a Beauty Pie Triple Beauty Perfect Glow Powder. So yes, Barbie is probably very knackered. She just wants to be left alone. And as for Ken, Ken is probably bold now <laughs> with a beer belly. <laughs> Let's do it really pink. That smells of something nice. So for my eyes, I could use the Tartlet Juicy. Can you see that row here is all pinks? Or Huda Beauty rose quartz or you could use the dupe for it from alter ego the coastal palette but the very first barbies didn't look so hot <laughs> their hair looked really dry and yellow what i'm going to do i've got here a sigma eyeshadow base primer and i might put it let me bring my mirror i might put it on my mobile lid now I obviously don't have proper Barbie eyelid I have hoods but we need to create somehow this cut crease let me first put all over my eyelid to set to set that uh, from Huda Beauty Cherished this pale pink Now with the Aura from Huda Beauty, I'm going to try, this is a Morphe M213 tiny brush to make a crease. I 
the crease goes from here. Very difficult to make a nice sharp crease when you've got very low skin on your eyes. <laughs> So, I'm just going to blend that upwards a bit. So, did you have Barbies when you were little? I've never ever had a Barbie because of some of you my now, I was born in then communist Poland and we didn't know anything about the West. We had no Western influence on our country at all. We never had any television programs from the West. We just didn't know what's happening there apart from what they told us and I think by the time the Barbie came to Poland um, I was too old to play with it so I am just going over that crease color and keep blending it I need to go with that light pink again a bit higher now to that crease this is that cherished color and then we sort of blow it up here and pull it outwards now I'm going to put Moon Magic from the Huda Beauty right on the middle of my eyelid because I think you have to have some sparkle when you are a Barbie now I'm going to take happiness which is a bit darker pink and go slightly over that crease color with Rifa 13 Oh, that is quite, that sparkly eyeshadow has lots of particles in it, so it's all over my face now. Now I'm going to put this really shiny one in the corner. This is from Marks and Spencer's. This is Shadow Stick in Rosie for Autograph. I don't know how I have it, why I have it. Mind you, it's not that shiny. Maybe I will use this eyeshadow from the Juicy Palette. Now, I have to do liquid liner which might end up looking a mess because Barbie has a definitely a black eyeliner and she's got that shape eyes and I have that shape eyes so we will see I have here the Benefit roller liner and I might have to get a bit closer to my mirror to try to do this Now I'm going to take a flesh color or white pencil. What is this one? This is Maybelline, I think. Oh no, this is Bell Hypoallergenic. And then I'm going to pull it out right under that black liner because that opens up my eyes and maybe gives me a bit more of that Barbie eye shape
Now I'm going to take a Charlotte Tilbury's pencil, the classic pencil, and I don't know, I think this might be the Audrey one, it's a brown one. And I will go here under this white. Smudge it a bit. What's this? I'm taking the gratitude from that Huda palette and going over it. Just trying to give myself these dull eyes. Now I'm taking Serenity and just going a bit higher here with this pink. And now let's do mascara. Okay, and now I think we will do eyelashes. I'm going to use the BK Beauty with Risa Das Makeup in Vegas. Yes, it would be very funny if they did a movie with 60 something year old Barbie. She can't deal with losing her beauty. So she gets Botox and fillers. I had to trim, trim these at the ends because they were a bit too long. But they are gorgeous. I haven't used those before. These are really, really good lashes. Remember, I used the Martini, which are just um, outer corner lashes. These are really lovely. Okay, <laughs> so eyes are done. Let's do the lips. Now, I don't have like a really Barbie pink lipstick, but what I've read, that apparently they've used Lisa Eldridge makeup on a set and the lipsticks, especially the lipsticks. And actually when you look um, at the trailer, they don't seem to be wearing these really, really pink lips. So I have here Lisa Eldridge lip liner in no one knows so the lipstick is velvet beauty and this is in beauty as well yeah in beauty she has matching pencils so let's do this one and maybe we'll pink it up somehow mind you this is quite pink These lipsticks, Lisa Eldridge's lipsticks, are beautiful. Yeah, it needs to be a bit brighter, doesn't it? What if I... That's it. If I put over it um, Charlotte Tilbury Velvet Underground. And then in the middle, I have this very, very old uh, gloss from L'Oreal, Glam Shine. Do you remember that one? Moonlight. Just put it in the middle. So I just put this little twilly in my hair and that is your 53 year old Barbie. <laughs> 
I had so much fun. You know how much I love makeup and obviously I wouldn't go out anywhere like this but it gives me so much pleasure just to do a fun video like this so I can play with makeup. I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching and stay fabulous. Bye!